sorry to interrupt, Mr. Verrilli, but let's assume, just for the sake of argument, assume I don't agree with that, and then we get to severability. Um, I tend to agree with you on that this is a very straightforward case for severability under our precedence, meaning that we would excise the mandate and leave the rest of the act in place, uh, reading our severability precedence. One of my questions is, do you think that would have been the right result under the 2010 Act, or did that change in 2017, or, or how would you assess that? 